Back in Budapest, hometown hero Martin was among the field at the Gazprom Hungarian Open, one of the most enjoyable events on the tour. The tournament makes it uh, very easy for players to come to the site. It's one of the most beautiful cities that I've been in, and it's really true. Budapest is, is really a great city with a lot of sightseeing things. The boat that goes just five minutes to the courts and it's really easy and then it goes very fast. It's really nice uh, going on the river under all the bridges that they have in Budapest. Thank you. And it's, it makes this tournament even much better. It's the small details that count and uh, just being able to, to take the boat or you know walk around the city. It's, uh, it's really cool things we don't get to do every week, so uh, it's what makes a tournament like this really enjoyable to come to. Being one of the top four seeds is honestly a privilege, so uh, it gives me a little bit more time to prepare. Definitely feel a lot more comfortable playing on clay now. I didn't grow up playing on it. Once I learned how to play on it, I feel like my game could be really effective. It was nice to win on the, on the first tournament here in, uh, in Budapest. Every week there is so many good and great players on the tour and it's never easy to, to win a tournament. My goal is not just to, to go in the top 10 for a few days and then get out. It's just to finish into the top 10 at the end of the year, try to be in London for the Masters at the end. It is a good feeling to come back after I play the final. Budapest is close to Slovenia, so basically I drove here. And we don't get that too often, so after Monte Carlo I went back home for a few days and uh, enjoyed my time with my wife and uh, yeah, came here to Budapest, so mentally ready. There's a lot of exciting players um, at this tournament and you, know, you have to play the best to win it. It's going to be an exciting tournament, I think. There's a lot of things you can do around Budapest. It's very compact. All the side activities are trying to you know, help the players get to know the city and also help the city to get to know the players. Hi, I'm Andrea Seppi. I'm here with my wife in Budapest. We are going to have a sightseeing with the boat of the city. Very romantic. <laughs> here we see the oldest building in Budapest. On the boat right now, enjoying the city from the river. Some fresh air in the face. Very nice one. Small kiss, please. <laughs> Just a chance to do some stuff like this. It's for sure very unique and fun. We really enjoy the moment here. We just finished our boat trip. Yeah, now it's time to go back on the practice court. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> hey, I'm Alex Bublik and we're in Budapest. And I got a walker right here and ready to go to the player's party. I'm here with the best dressed guy on a player's party. I'm learning from you all the time. You have style, so I want the same Bublik style, that's why. Liverpool or Roma? Massive Liverpool fan. I'm going to watch it over at uh, the pub next door to the the, uh, the hotel. Go Liverpool, Mohamed Salah. Liverpool. This city is very nice. What do you think? Actually, I was last year and I was amazed with the, with the views, with the, with the buildings. Hey guys, really enjoyed the player spot in Budapest. I'm playing 11 o'clock, so now it's time to get to my room. Perfect. Next week on ATP World Tour Uncovered, there's action from Estoril, Munich and Istanbul. And we catch up with Kyle Edmund, the British star breaking new ground. Don't forget to log on to atpworldtour.com and chat with us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. See you next week.